It's spring in the northern Sierra Nevada mountains. And all across the Tahoe National Forest, wildland firefighters are getting ready. Fire season is coming. This summer and fall, wildland firefighters will be on high alert. When smoke is reported, Tahoe National Forest firefighters respond. Even small flames can grow into a large, destructive wildfire. Fighting fire in wildlands is far different than in an urban setting. Tahoe National Forest engines and hand crews are some of the first to arrive at a wildfire incident. The engines carry water and hose lays are deployed through rugged terrain. Hose lays enable firefighters to engage in direct attack, dousing the flames. Hand crews also encircle the wildfire with fire line. Fire line is constructed with chainsaws, hand tools, and sweat. Vegetation and fuels are removed to bare mineral soil. By removing all burnable material, fire line can stop a wildfire's progression. The work will be tough and the hours will be long. Extensive preparation is needed and this spring is no exception. Tools are meticulously maintained and organized. Engines are examined and tested. Firefighting teams drill and practice in the presence of live fire, mimicking conditions they will soon face. Wildland firefighting requires top physical conditioning. Firefighters engage in cardio and strength training. On the Tahoe National Forest, the question is not if a wildfire will occur, but when. And when it does, we will be ready.